Hi, my name is Kelsey Hahn. I am the founder of Gray Lane Yoga. I originally started my yoga journey back in 2009 um, on my Wii Fit board, and um, that carried me throughout college until my senior year, um, and I finally stepped foot inside a studio, and I had originally began a career, or wanted to pursue a career in English education, and found myself altering my path to take on yoga, and quickly after my yoga certification, I met my, who is now my husband, and quickly after that, um, we found out we were pregnant with our son, Asher, so it's really been a whirlwind of the last 10 years. Yoga just found its way into my life, and it was kind of like from that first moment that I took a class, I knew it was for me because of how it made me feel. I'm someone who often kind of felt like they were just around, not always like felt like they had a place where they belonged. And in yoga, I felt like I belonged here, like within my body. So when we opened Gray Lane, it was a beacon, a beacon of light, just like I have always tried to be for people to just feel like they belong somewhere, feel like they're seen, like someone cares about them, that they really want to be an active part of their life. And so that's kind of what got me to be where I am. And now I have um, ran Gray Lane Yoga for the last, we're starting our fourth year, um, which is just wild again. Four years ago, the pandemic was. Time is just so strange. Um, but now I am the uh, owner and I have four instructors underneath of me that are pursuing their dreams and again helping us expand upon our mission to guide others towards a life lived with self-love through the practice of yoga. I wanted to intentionally land in Waterloo. I feel like Waterloo is one of those underserved communities that people just like graze by or we don't have a great reputation. But there is a collective of people that is really trying to revitalize and revamp and just reassert that we're here and we are Waterloo. Um, to fly that W, I think is what the mayor's slogan is, is to fly the W. And so I think I was in shock when I initially got the phone call. But accepting my place at the table, per se, has been the it's been like a little bit of a struggle, almost that imposter syndrome, which I'm assuming a lot of people on our list probably feel as well. I know I'm probably not alone, um, but I was excited, but also like there's this great responsibility along with something like that, and I'm honored, just really honored to be a part of all of it.